What's going on, everybody? This is Marcus, and uh, I'm here alone again uh, with another quick cast, as I like to call it. And this is just where I bring more extra content to you all. Uh, I'm a very creative dude, so I'm always looking for a reason to create more content, right? We all are. And so I thought, hey, this would be really a dope way to uh, bring more content to you, the listener, and give you something something to help you get through your day, a little, a little something extra, right? So... I'm just going to kind of vent on things I find out on the Internet, uh, things I find uh, uh, when surfing the net. And so we're going to talk about something that we haven't touched on yet, but we're going to we're going to get into it. Right. We're going to talk about it. Uh, And that's the whole metaverse. uh, This this whole new world. Right. And how some individuals are are saying there's ways to invest in virtual real estate okay so as you can tell i'm a bit i'm already just kind of like yeah whatever because my thing is is like there's not enough real real estate going to to to, to go to go around like that's what we really as investors need to be trying to invest in and we really need to be passing down from generation to generation. I mean, especially in our community, you know, we know that we were historically, you know, uh, historically we've we've had issues with with being redlined and and being, uh, you know, having different different hurdles placed before us when it comes to owning land and owning property and we need to be we need to be on that right but now we have this virtual real estate right and it seems to be the flavor of the day um the market is changing and so a lot of this crypto nft uh web3 you know metaverse talk is definitely being quelled you know when the market is like not doing good people really strap down and i mean the 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 the, the nft thing is only something that can be created in an in an up market i mean selling a a blocked chain original digital image for millions of dollars i mean that's only that's that's some first world stuff right there right <clears throat> so that could only happen in an up market but now that the market is experiencing some some lows inflation has kicked up you know we we went a lot different world than we were in in december and november of 2021 when this whole metaverse nft talk really was bubbling but with that said this came across uh the internet came across my my desk and it is i'm gonna put it up here on the jumbotron if you're watching on youtube metaverse mortgage (laughs) yes uh you did not hear me stutter metaverse mortgage so now if you're looking to get virtual real estate but you don't have the money right you just don't have it all right now don't don't worry because a company called Terra Zero Technologies uh, last week issued one of the first ever mortgages in the metaverse, a network of virtual worlds where users can interact and experience entertainment and trade. Okay, we're talking about a big video game here, okay? My kids play a game, they're glued to a game called Roblox. Robux? Robux, I believe it's called. Anyway, it's pretty much like Sims for anyone over 30 plus. It's Sims, uh, you know, they're able to go to these different worlds that have been created by other users. They're able to communicate with people all over the world and they have their own currency. And my son wanted to, I spent $80 getting him this fake currency for his ninth birthday. So, this is all in that realm, right? But this metaverse is kind of geared towards adult interaction, 
which to me is just, it's just the whole idea of it is it's kind of creepy now i don't want to sign the old guy in the room but for me i just think that there's better ways to invest like unless you've tapped into all of the other proven and tested ways to invest unless you've you know paid off your debt or brought your you know emergency fund up to a nice you know reasonable amount or unless you got all your other boxes checked you shouldn't be really looking into stuff like this and you for dang show shouldn't be looking into mortgaging real estate in the metaverse right but this company has a mortgage and it says the tech firm issued the two-year mortgage <laughs> yeah they issued the two-year mortgage with an undisclosed down payment and interest rate oh that's awesome so they're not even telling you what the down payment is going to be or what the interest rate is going to be all right uh let's see what else they're saying here let me uh see what else they're saying so it starts uh with a forty-five thousand dollar parcel of land in decentral land that's the name of this world in the metaverse it's a metaverse with approximately ninety-two thousand parcels all right now here's the thing that that always has frustrated me about this uh metaverse real estate uh conversation okay they say it's limited they say that's the benefit it's it's a limited amount of land because that's the only thing that makes real estate uh valuable is that there is a finite amount anything that you invest in the value is in the 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 fact that it's finite there's only a certain amount of this right that's what that's what brings it its value and they're saying that there's only so much digital real estate well that's funny because there was a point in time when there was no such thing as as uh metaverse or digital real estate right and someone created it so what's stopping said someone from creating more of it it's digital it's not real right what who said like i just i can't wrap my mind around the fact that there's a finite amount of digital anything right but that's what they want to sell you on that's also the crypto sale right it's it's it's, it's a finite amount okay okay I, I, i'm not gonna get you know i'm not gonna get into it with you about that you know do do do, do what you want to do but i'm just saying for me this seems kind of outrageous kind of outlandish kind of crazy right to mortgage virtual real estate and so yeah they have an undisclosed uh down payment and an undisclosed interest rate and the firm says it's going to follow traditional um, uh, vetting of mortgages or mortgagees so i don't know man y'all let me know what you think in the comment section below is this crazy <clears throat> is this the new wave w what do you think about this uh and are you going to be investing in in you know the metaverse you know what i mean we really don't know what it's what it's going to look like the, the metaverse is something that you know zuckerberg kind of his his brainchild and there already are companies that are creating little worlds within within the metaverse i like to think the metaverse is like a gaming system right and uh terra zero is just a game within the system right just like robux is a game with you know on whatever platform you're doing the computer or your ipad or whatever but they create the, these worlds uh within the metaverse and so that's where we're at with it um y'all let me know what you think if you ask me man i'm going staying in the stock the real stock market and the real real estate that's where i'm at uh y'all let me know what you think i hope you enjoyed this podcast this is a quick cast with your boy uh marcus from black mary dead free until next time we out